morning. Oh shoot, I forgot to change my battery. Best I guess I better get on it. All right, I should have done that. My battery's gonna die partway through this video you watch. I better keep an eye on it. All right guys, good morning. Hope you all had a nice night. Listen, don't mind my little twisty turban. It's, it's okay. I did that on purpose, Tracy. I saw you say that. I saw you say that and I'm like, I'm going live right now. Good morning, Debbie. Good morning. Hey, Rita. Hey, Dawn. <laughs> hey, Tracy. Hey, Faith. Hey, Kathy. Hey, Jen. Hey, Sherry. Hey, Debbie. Hey, Cindy. Hey, Becky. Hey, Donna. Hey, Carrie. All right, guys, this morning I'm going to make Field of Greens Ohm Cake, which is on page 240 of Trim Healthy Cookbook. Good morning, Mumsy. I am, so this recipe is part of the Stubborn, it's part of a lot of menus, but it's part of the Stubborn Losers menu, and that's why I'm having it today. And I like this. Even though the first time I made it, I was like, oh, Lord, this is going to scare me. I actually really like it. I actually really like it. I just can't get my spinach open. All right, so basically, this is a spinach omelet. Don't let it scare you. Don't let the name um, cake scare you. I know that's not what it means. It's supposed to be omelet cake. A chocolate secret big boy in addition to your toast. So that's a little bit more fuel than you need. So you can have it, Tracy, in addition to your toast, but you should lighten up on the protein because part of the Stubborn Losers menu is making sure you're not overdoing the protein or anything. Your extra okra is perfectly fine. All right, I chop up my spinach. I've got a third of a cup of fresh parsley and I'm gonna put a cup of spinach in there. I chop it up because I have to. Cooked spinach needs to be chopped for me to really enjoy it. So, I like it that way. So I'm just gonna zing it up with my parsley. So I have it little chopped pieces. It says, it says finely chopped. So I'm gonna chop it fine. Kinda like my hair, fine. All right, let's chop this baby up. I always gotta look, I never remember how to do it. Piece of spinach that won't come down. There you go. I love this stuff, are you guys? Do you have dry parsley, Sherry? You can use dry parsley. That's what I usually use. I just why did I hit that button? All right, it's finely chopped now. Do it, Cindy. It's better that way. All right, look, cover didn't even get dirty. All right. Oh, I hate the smell of parsley. Horrible. It smells. It smells like fresh parsley to me. Smells like cilantro. I hope I didn't buy cilantro by mistake. No, it's parsley. It stinks terribly, but that's all right. I can deal. All right, so I'm gonna actually put my eggs and everything in the chopper with it, zing it up all together. So two eggs and an eggshell, you know, so a little extra protein. Might lose an extra pound if you eat that. I'm kidding. Nobody eat their eggshells because KJ said it makes you lose weight. It's not true. Um, if you haven't seen yet, y'all, I posted on my page and out on the Trim Healthy Mama page a video that I did last night of four different holiday creamers, you guys. I have gingerbread, eggnog, sugar cookie, and add some egg whites. Sugar cookie and 
peppermint mocha in there. Fuel pull to the extent that, girl, you can have, if the only fat in your meal comes from your creamer, you could have an entire cup of creamer. <laughs> they're, they're low, low, and they're good, good. All right, spinach, salt, pepper, and cayenne. I can do that. Pepper. Which one did you make, Debbie? Did you make the plain or did you make one of the flavors? Yes, go check out that video, you guys. It's going to die on the main page if nobody goes and shares it or anything because those links and stuff, people just scroll past it. So go comment and get it going because people have been begging for these creamers. So I want people to know that they can make them and they can make, they can drink a whole crap ton of them. All right, cayenne, what else? Mix your eggs, egg whites, parsley and seasonings. Wait, oh, add spinach and combine well. Okay, AKA put it in your zinger. Combine well means put it in your chopper because you're lazy. Okay. Pour egg mixture into your skillet. I've only made this once. Can you tell I have to literally read? Hey, Kathy. Good morning. I'm making the fields of green home cake. This is what I'm making. Fields of green home cake. Pour the egg mixture into your skillet and cook it. Okay. I'm supposed to use a spray of coconut oil, but listen, I ignore that. You do you, boo. If you want to do coconut oil, you go ahead. I'm doing Pam. Coconut oil spray. I might as well rub the cat's butt all over that pan. It doesn't work. It's a good thing I don't have a cat. Poor thing. Carrie, the Stubborn Losers menu is on the Trim Healthy Mama membership site, which if y'all don't have, you should get, even if you only get it through the holidays, go sign up, buy three months, use my code if you've never done it before because you saved 10 bucks, and then get rid of it when you're done if you don't want to keep it. But you can get 20, you can, for 25 bucks, you can get three months access, print off as many recipes and menus as you want. And if you use my code, it's 15 bucks for three months. And girl, there are some good menus out there. Just go print them all. Get some ink for your printer and print all those recipes. I feel like I didn't put enough cayenne in there. It's not burning my eyes yet. What are you doing, girl? All right. I'm supposed to set that over medium heat, not hot. Pour it in. It's looking mighty horrid. I say this every time I've had it. I think it's I've had it twice actually. And every time I make it, I'm like, ew, this looks disgusting. And then I love it. So I need to get over myself. Okay, let that cook. I should I should rinse this up now. Rinse it before it rinse all that spinach down the sink before my husband gets up and saw that I did that and has a head fat. I know how to do things. Don't worry. I know how to take care of business. Don't rinse food down the sink, Kelly. It's not good for the septic. It's bad for the septic. <laughs> Whatever. Myself a little. All right. Goodness gracious. Thank you for the stars, Bonnie. Thank you so much, you guys. When you send me stars, it financially supports my journey and it supports my cooking of all these videos. Because let's face it, <laughs> I spend a fair amount on food that I end up giving away or um, goes unfortunately some of it to waste because I do a lot of cooking videos <laughs> and I buy a lot of stuff 
for just me. And then I don't have, like I'll do a different menu the next week. And I don't, it needs all new ingredients. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Sarah. I mean, I love doing it, don't get me wrong, but groceries getting expensive. Good night. And I've tried to make different recipes for the whole year. So it's, and it's worked out. I love doing it. So thank you. Thank you, Becky. I appreciate it, guys. All right, um, let's put my stuff away. I'm gonna cook that on medium. It's gonna take all day. My battery on my GoPro is gonna die. Let me look, where are we at? Where are we at? 10%, we're all right. We're all right, we got it. I know they were having an issue. Every time I try to get a recipe in the recipe finder, it takes me back to the homepage. Um, I know they were having an issue last week, but I thought they'd fixed it. Uh, yeah, Anne Marie. I mean, like Anne Marie said, I would definitely call or message customer service because I thought they had fixed it. Yes, you're right, Sherry. Fresh is, oh my gosh. Groceries are outrageous right now. Outlandish. I've been wanting to use that word for years. I have wanted to use the word outlandish, never had a need. That is outlandish. And look at that, I successfully used it. All right, I need a cup. I want one of my tall baldars today. I'm gonna add some of my cold brew and my creamer. I was afraid these were gonna separate because sometimes things separate. They didn't, look at that. Look at that beautiful creamer, y'all. That. Yes, all of Nation Extracts are awesome. And if you get them, use my promo code because you'll save 15%. And who doesn't like saving money? And it's not just the first time, it's any time. Any time you buy coffee on Unrest, an Almond Cow, a, no, not an almond cow, a coffee bear or Olive Nation, you use my promo code JOYFULKJ and you save money. I don't know why I did that. Oh, I did that so you could smell. Can you smell it? Oh, it smells just like eggnog. I need to check my own okay. Okay, cook it till it's brown and then what? I would imagine flip it. I just can't remember. Pour the egg mixture, blah, blah, blah. Flip the ohm cake over and brown on the other side about two minutes. Okay. Okay. This says get a large dinner plate. I have one of those right here. Large dinner plate. Slide the ohm cake onto the large dinner plate and drizzle with coconut oil or red palm oil and sprinkle with nutritional yeast. I'm not a big red palm oil on top of things. Bam. Bitter. Man, I am hungry, y'all. My stomach is growling. So I need a teaspoon, right? A tablespoon? A tablespoon of coconut oil. Girl, yeah. I'm all right with that. Looks about right. That's good for you. All right, what we got? Almost done. I gotta heat up my, melt my coconut oil. Who just made the sick face? What, Tracy? Oh, coconut oil? That's cause you overdone it, girl. All right, I got my coffee bear. Whoa and it stuck to the cover of my cocoa. That was almost disastrous. All right, got to take out my dough here. See if I can make a mess like I did the other day. Take off the cover over the trash. Dump out my browns. Look at that, I did it this time without getting it all over my floor. I probably shouldn't say that quite yet. Just rinse that 
back down the sink. Nobody saw that. I'm gonna wipe, I got some grounds in the cover. I gotta shut off my own cake before she burns. Goodness gracious. Did you use the, what cake was it? It's a single serve cranberry cake. Is it one from the membership site, Sarah? Or is it like something you tweaked? Let me go get mine. I know that lemon cake, Sherry Graham's lemon cake that was on the Stubborn Losers menu the other day. I got the other cups. Was fantastic. Okay, slide it onto the pan. Look at that hideous thing. Looks terrible, but it's gonna be delightful. All right, a cold brew that's dripping because I didn't put the cover on tight enough. Oh, leave room for creamer, KJ. Like I said, this cream, the sugar cookie creamer, you wanna keep to a quarter cup because it has cacao butter in it. But this one, the almond milk, you can have a whole half a, half a cup. Well, you can have a whole cup. I'm having a half a cup. And listen, let me get my all. <laughs> Before I say listen, let me get my coconut oil. It says drizzle, and then I got to put, all right, drizzle. This sounds weird, drizzling coconut oil over your breakfast. I hope that said a tablespoon. That looks like a lot of oil. It did. All right, looks like a lot of oil. I'm gonna poke some holes in. Oh, that's right, the nutritional yeast kind of soaks it up some. Kind of all over the place this morning. Gotta have my nooch. Does it say how much? One to two teaspoons. I eat more than that. One teaspoon. Two. Listen, don't be for. <coughs> Don't joke. Don't be freaked out by this recipe. It's delish. And this is the most important ingredient right here. Thank you for the stars, Mary Jo. It still says Spanish. Every time somebody sends, sends them, it just says, Sequidor de Hito. Thank you for being a Sequidor de Hito. I don't know what that means. All right. Anywho, y'all, I know you're thinking, a half a cup of creamer. Listen, when you have those international delights and you go pouring it in here, you think you're getting a teaspoon. You are not getting a teaspoon. You're getting a half a cup. It's going glug, glug, glug. You know it is. So it's okay. Have some creamer. Listen, I'd have more than that if there'd been room in my cup. I made a Fields of Green Ohm Cake, Chrissy, and I put my new creamer in my jar. I think I got probably a quarter cup in there. <gasps> Drop an ice. Mmm. It's good. Thank you, Monica. You know why I'm putting some more? Because I can. It doesn't bother mine, Lindley. And by the way, your name is stupid cute. Linley. Is, am I saying it right? Linley. I love that. I've never heard that name before. Linley. That is so pretty. No, this allulose does not hurt my stomach. Oh my gosh. Eggnog. <coughs> Choke it on it. That is good. All right, there we go. I have my hideous breakfast and my delicious coffee. My hideous breakfast is gonna taste absolutely fabulous even though it's hideous. Ugly food tastes good. So good. And it's so good with Cholula. I like Cholula. And I buy the garlic kind. Garlic, ch chili garlic. Yeah. 